what aspect of Dutch dating culture do you think people find most challenging? Ooh, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> it's so hard because I never dated a Dutch guy before. Okay. So it could be a general I, person. It doesn't have to be Dutch um, specific. Yeah. I think Dutch guys aren't really romantic. Oh, really? Yeah. So if I want to go on a date, I got to plan the date. I got to say that I got to tell them when, how and what we're going to do. So they're not going to do that. No. To me personally challenging. I'm from the Caribbean, so my interests and things that I like to do um if we're talking like in the Dutch culture is different because yeah, in the Netherlands is primarily uh, Caucasian based right yeah of course you have people of different ethnicities and different cultures but like navigating the dating scene can be different especially like for me I feel more comfortable expressing myself in English yeah even though uh, Dutch is my second language like being in a partnership with someone I wouldn't feel comfortable speaking Dutch 24 7 even though ironically my boyfriend at this moment he's Dutch but he, he speaks English fluently, so mm. we communicate in English all the time. Okay. So definitely in that aspect, for me personally, dating is hard because like, yeah, I can't express my love language the way you want to, want to in Dutch. And like dating? Yeah. Um, I wouldn't know. We, we met very early on. So yeah, oh, really? we've already yeah. been together for three years. Yo, <laughs> how did that happen? It was dating experience in, like, since you moved here. Ah, uh, yeah. I do. That's why I can tell you they're not romantic. <laughs> what was the last one? What happened? Um, I think this guy asked me out. He told me where we were gonna, what we were gonna do. Yeah. So I came there. I was on time for the first time in my life. I was on time. I waited for this guy for almost an hour, and he no, didn't show, didn't up. show up. No, no. no. How yeah. How dare he? Yeah. Has he seen you? <laughs> I don't know. Pictures. I don't know, but it was after that. I've, I haven't dated anyone else. No. no. Have you tried dating other cultures and races as well? <sighs> well, maybe I should be open to that. Mm. Maybe I should do that mm. because the black men aren't treating me right. <laughs> <laughs> Not our black brothers putting us no, to shame. No, they're putting. Yeah, they do. They be doing. I'm sorry. <laughs> Where, where are the kind of places you, or you probably are most likely meet a partner? Like, where do you typically go on apps or what do you meet in person or...? Uh, yeah, that's a good question. <laughs> um, for me, I would say, like, in real life situations, like going out and stuff like that, um, for me, I personally find that more difficult. Even though if I go to things that I'm primarily interested in, um, it's hard to navigate. Like, for instance, I can give you an example. Like, during my time from university, that's why I came to the Netherlands okay. to study. Um, like, I would be the only black girl in a oh, class, wow. or there wouldn't be other people of color or even other black people. So, you know, based on European standards and whatnot, like, if you're in a university setting and you have a bunch of, like, guys or whatever, well... Yeah. I'm interested in men, so yeah. I'll just put that out there. So it's like I am not their per se cup of tea that yeah. they would like uh, to be interested in romantically. So at least for me, uh, during COVID, I tried something out of the box, did the dating app thing, and yeah, I was fortunate that I found someone that I clicked with who happens to be my boyfriend right now. Oh, yeah. that is so amazing. Have you, did you have any last question on dating? Have you had any worst dating experience you want to share? Uh, in, the in the Netherlands, yeah. no, not okay. per se. I haven't. Okay. I've been fortunate. <laughs> I haven't had any terrible dating experiences. Oh, I've so heard of friends you. that have had terrible dating. You, experiences. Can you remember anything that happened? Um, I, I'd rather not say okay. because I know this friend is very private. So <laughs> uh, we met in high school in our last year. Oh. But I guess like with dating here yeah you can't really be spontaneous okay so like i feel like in the dutch culture everything is very planned okay like if we want to do something fun like one night you can't really you can't, can't really go out and do oh, something fun okay. spontaneously so it's like, you have very, to be very planned. planned like so you have like have a date like you have to plan, like a week or two weeks ahead yeah, of time exactly <laughs> okay fair. and then it's still expensive like Ooh. it's very expensive okay. to do fun stuff okay but. fair fair fair